Holy just take fuck. a minute, just take a minute. Hey everybody, what's going on? From Rock Solid Gaming, I'm Brady Godden, and you're watching The Hot Seat. We put our guests through a series of wings to see how hot they can truly handle. The show is presented by Rock Solid Gaming and sponsored by Rocketeer Treats and Winging It. Thank you both for the sponsors. We appreciate it. On today's episode, we have a content creator, social media influencer, Mr. Justin Hako. I don't even know what camera to look at. I'm looking look at, at this I, one, I was this looking one, at that, that one, one for the longest time, and I realized, oh, there's one right there. Appreciate you being on the show, man. I'm sure you're a busy fucking dude, and you got a lot of Yeah, man, I appreciate you guys having me and reaching out. No, I know no Mike problem. did it, so I'm excited to try to live up to his legacy. Yeah, yeah. We'll tell you after we're done filming if you did better or not. Okay. All right, we'll, we'll get into that. I'm no? excited to do it. All right, bro, let's do it. Cheers. Let's get it. You want to tell people that you put up a second one? Oh, yeah, I have. Um, I didn't know what to bring, so. Well, I wanted more beer, so they... <laughs> Instead of, I don't have bear. milk. I don't need milk. I just need to get drunk. That's right. Bear and wings, man. That's like not fucking obscure. Is this it? is just like shooting shit, drinking some bear and eating some wings. There you go. Right? Yeah. All right, man. We'll get started. Uh, you know, this one, the first one is Stubbs. Nothing too crazy. Okay. You won't, um, you won't, you won't squint around like this on this one. Stubbs. Yeah, man. Also, you can find all this anywhere on the uh, shelves, like in local. Fuck you, flam that, huh? I don't fuck around, man. <laughs> Stubbs got some fright. I just noticed seats on your shirt. Yeah. That's sick. Right I'm, I'm doing it with like Mike is going to be my spirit animal here today. <laughs> yep. Watching yep. over me. I see that. I see that. So, uh, yeah, man, you usually start the video by, you know, telling the viewers and the audience and stuff about yourself, what you got going on, stuff like that, man. Um, I, we make, um, I'm Justin, I'm from the outhouse. We make content. We used to do weekly content, but now we're lazy, so we just do it whenever we think of a funny idea. Lazy. Which is like once every three months. Yeah. I honestly assumed you were in preparation. What do you mean? Like, you know, the couple months that you were taking to upload videos, I figured that was like yeah, preparation and stuff like that. But you know? it is now. Because like we used to just come out with one every single week. So you didn't have time to think. You're mm -hmm. just like, go, 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 go. But now, um, come up with an idea. You let it flush through. And I think now like the videos are getting like the last one we did with uh, Lannis Morris Shed. Mm -hmm. I think like, yeah, like wicked. there's so many parts of that that was so funny to me and mm -hmm. funny to Mike. And you wouldn't be able to do that if you just did it a weekly show. That was fucking hilarious, show. man. That's yeah, so we, we started think, thinking of that one like probably like two months before we shot it. Mm. Sweet, man. And um, yeah, and it's just better to shoot videos like that because you have more time. There's no time frame. When we were shooting a video and trying to put one up every single week, holy fuck, man. It was crazy. I thought about to say, holy fuck, this is hot. That's what I thought you were about to do. You were I'm sure to say. I will say that. Nah, we'll, 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 no, you'll be fine until we get to like hair or so. Yeah, sure. This area. You'll actually enjoy these next few. Uh, this one here is Chipotle. Yep. Same brand as this one over here. Okay. So this one's not too bad again. I believe 13,000 Scoville, something like that. Okay. All right, let's get it up. Drums or flats? I love drums. Yeah? How about you? Yeah. I don't like that I find this one hot already. What, this one? It's not like that hot, but if that's number two, I'm kind of scared right no, now. No, believe me, you're good. That one hates people differently every time. It's like a little surprise we got there. Trust me, it'll be fine. Okay. I, I, all my trust is in you. Yeah. I mean, we just met a couple mm -hmm. minutes ago, but mm -hmm. I fucking trust you like a brother. So yeah, man, you've been creating content for, damn, man, like 16 freaking years. Yeah, since I was a little kid. Since yeah, a little bro. baby boy. I seen. I see. Is it a passion of yours? Like, is there is is it just for fun or is it just like do you have an angle? It's it? just for the money, really. <laughs> really? No, 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 it's not. You make good money out of it, though. Well, there's moments, I guess. Yeah. But like, I think for me, um, it's just a passion. Like, even if like no matter what happens, I feel like there will never be a year in my life where I don't create like a video or create something. I'm no obsessed with creating shit. I don't. I didn't want to bring it up yet, but now around the topic of it, I'll bring it up. Okay. But it's. Uh, Dude gets sprayed in the face. Oh, with piss. With piss. Yeah, that was me in yeah. high school. And I always look back at that video and like, because we, we made a jackass video back when we were in high school and uh, about seven of my friends peed in a super soaker. Then we sprayed me in the face with it. You didn't look too happy. And we could have easily faked that. 
could have. And we didn't. No, it was, it was seven actual dudes piss. piss. Yeah, seven dudes piss on my face. Dude, you took it too. Man, for like that's a solid just a, that's five just a Wednesday seconds. evening, buddy. That's just for a, a Wednesday solid evening. five seconds, you took that shit. And yeah, then you man. finally You know like what the screamed. grossest part was? My had long hair at the time. The grossest part was that it soaked my hair. And I was like, whatever. Pee's on my face. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm just like, mind over matter. Then my hair came back in my mouth. <laughs> And that's when I lost my mind, because now I'm just sucking on seven yeah, bro. people's piss. That's gross, man. Don't clip that. But, I mean, you know, to follow up on that, uh, it has 22, 22 23,000 views right now. Back really? when you, Yeah, bro. Like, back no, when you no. originally posted it. I didn't, yeah. like, yeah, I probably had no views, because I think, like, at the time, Newfoundland Versus, when that blew up, like, all the old videos yep. blew up. Because I guess Newfoundland Versus started, what, like, eight years ago? Uh, that started in, like, 2020. No, not 2020. Yeah. No, I'm gonna say 2010. So I don't okay. know why I said yeah, 2020. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So like 12 years ago. Yeah. Yeah. So, Justin yeah. Murphy's was the, like one of the main characters mm -hmm. of that. Great guy. I was too. with him uh, last night actually, and I told him I was doing this, and yeah, he was he like, say? "I would never fucking do that." That's what he said. No. He's not, he's not a spicy dude. I guess he's not a spicy dude. No. Yeah. Uh, okay, so heartbeat hot sauce jalapeno. This is a fan. These two here are delicious, in my opinion. Okay. Um, yeah, man. Let's get it. Let's see. Man, I am starved. This one tastes good, yeah. Yeah. This one, the next one, and this one here. Three of my favorites. I'm going to buy lots of that one, I bet. This one here? Yeah. That'd be delicious, man. I'm going to go home and put on everything. <laughs> go, go home and get so excited, you go to wing it and buy more. This was also made by Wing It, too. Oh, really? Yeah. So this is the sauce that Wing It provided us. Okay. That's the one that got the... When you go to Wing It, you have to sign a waiver. To try okay. It. So it's hot. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you've heard of it. Yeah, that was classic. No fear of death. It kind of looks like um, I thought it was Hot Ones uh, thing when I first looked at it. No, they got the bomb. So yeah, man. Before we like to dive too into it, I want to like clarify this because looking in from the outside, you're looking at like Jayhawks Twenty Three YouTube video or channel and the outhouse. Like, do you own both of those? Like, how does that? Uh, yeah, well, Jayhawk23 is a YouTube channel. Yeah. So it's just like a channel I made when I was a kid, and I called myself Jayhawk23, and then all of a sudden the videos blew up, so I stuck with that. Mm -hmm. And uh, the outhouse is just something that we made for Facebook to host videos on and shit like that. Okay. So technically, yeah, I own both, but like they're kind of the same fucking thing, because YouTube, it's just that like the YouTube channel is Jayhawk23. And I'm like too self-absorbed to change it to the outhouse because okay. I'm like it's my name. So. That's what I was always wondering. I was like, man, why is there always two different like, channels? He, but it's always self-absorbed. Or... No, no like, it was just always the same characters on both channels. I'm like, oh, it's the same fucking thing, except people, that uh, right? yeah, it's just YouTube and uh, Facebook. But I know that is you probably should have them both the same name. That's probably the best way to do it. But not here, buddy. No, not man. Here. Fair enough, man. Break that norm. Fuck it. Break the norm. Break so, that fucking norm. So which channel is is your? Uh, it seems to me like your Facebook is. Probably yeah, Facebook one. is like, yeah, Facebook is where you get the crazy views. So mm -hmm. you put up a video on Facebook that has like 100,000 views and it'll translate to YouTube to like 6,000. Oh, I believe it. Yeah. I believe it, man. We experienced the same thing here, man. I mean, I was looking at your guys' videos. You guys don't get bad views at all. On YouTube? Yeah, for like something that's just starting up and oh, like, yeah. like even my videos, like when we put something on YouTube, like we're only getting like... An average is like two or three thousand. Like it's not that much on YouTube at all. No, it's not. But YouTube is so freaking hard to grow, man. It is. You gotta yeah, be. You know about all that yourself. Yeah, you gotta be so like, uh, yeah, Logan Paul or someone. You gotta be like a good influencer on all these different socials, and posting everywhere, directing people to your YouTube, and then and then that's only half the battle. Then you gotta get people to watch more than three or four minutes of it, so your video goes in the algorithm. Exactly. YouTube. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like watch time is so important on YouTube. And right. like, uh, as things change, like with the TikTok generation, like now everything you need to have it's everything like that. Form. Like when, I, when we put out a comedy video, you need to have the joke got to come within like 30 seconds or mm -hmm. like everyone's like, fuck this is garbage. 100%. Uh, you nervous? Uh, yeah. You're like shaking your legs. Like oh no. I, when I sit down, I shake my legs. Oh, yeah? I okay. do that every day All right. of All my right. life. That's how I get my cardio. So which one we have right now? The blueberry one, right? Wild Blueberry and Scorpion, another good one too. Is it? Yes, sir. Okay. This one's pretty good now. Um, so, any of the viewers watching right now, I'm curious, they're probably Thank curious, because we watch videos where people end up in the background, or end up as a little character, and they're never seen again. Mm -hmm. Is there a process that the viewers can go about, like applying, or get in touch with you, if they want to be on one of your videos? Or is that just kind of like a bunch of close friends? 
It's a bunch of close friends. Yeah, like, okay. Yeah, like, I'm... Unless we... Because there's not a lot of time that we have, like, background actors in the videos. Like, usually it's just a couple people. Mm-hmm. And if we need background actors, we'll always just go to our close friends. Like, we, I mean, we never do, like, casting calls or, like... No. No. I mean, I guess it makes it easier for you, more comfortable for the guests or for the, you know, background exactly, people or yeah. whatever, right? And you can all have a drink, have a laugh and stuff at the same time. Yeah, and we have, like, a select, like... 20 people that are always like in and out of videos you know mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. how you feeling so far um feel good man my mouth's a little tingly but let's put it some I nice spice alive, it's know? a nice spice but ice I'm, spice you know who ice spice is i do yeah ice i spice. can't say nothing because i got a fiance i just want to watch the video but i, I know who it is <laughs> i don't even uh, yeah okay yeah okay yeah <laughs> <laughs> all right let's get into the sixth one this one is a favorite of mine uh the black cherry and reaper Delicious also. Same brand for these two right here. These three right here, I mean. Okay. That's fucking good. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go. Yeah, these are these two here, and this one here is the same brand. See, that was an explosion as I bit that. And this one here is the same brand. Yeah? But, like, sauce-wise? No, there was, like, chicken went everywhere, man. It was nuts. One time, we had a, we were filming the first episode, and the dude, like, coughed as he's eating. And, man, bro, I got fucking face full of chicken. Like, on video. Oh, God. I'm pretty sure the cameras are so, like, decently good that, like, they can see all the shreds, like, just... Put in slow-mo. <laughs> they shut up, bro. <laughs> they really shut up. But I don't think it ended up in slow-mo. So, I mean, back to, back to, uh, you know, Marcus in your videos and stuff. Because he's, man, he's, he's like, kind of, like, a big character now in the outhouse. He oh, always yeah. was, well, I guess. But he got this Between Two Boys show. Yeah. Right? Those, uh... Does he write these scripts? Do you write the scripts? Who 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 does all that behind the scenes? Uh, I usually write the I write all the scripts for the between two boys. Is it boys? Boys? Ah, uh, boys. Like fishing. It's a play on words, yeah. right? And buoys. Boys is what it should be. Yeah. And um, yeah, Marcus. Uh, he comes up. See, Marcus is perfect for like, coming up with shit on the fly. So he'll like come up with some shit like, like when you're filming, he'll say, "No, I should say this." And he's very good at like uh, freestyling, like impromptu on set or whatever. Uh, yeah, yeah. Im- improv is what yeah. I should have said. Improv. But I said freestyling. No, I mean the same thing. Well, yeah, good. so uh, Marcus is like amazing at that. But like, yeah, I write most of the scripts. It's either me or Mike. Mm-hmm. So me and Mike, like, would say when we did the Cecil video, like I would write the script, I'd give it to him, he'd rewrite it, send it back to me, I'd rewrite it. So like we would like just keep bouncing ideas back at each That's other like idea, that. Man. But with Marcus, he's more of a, just shows up and he's just like, show me what to say. Then he says it, but then like, he'll come up with shit as it's happening. Like, I should say this actually. And you're like, yes, that's way funnier. Wicked, man. I mean, the more brains, the better on it, eh, bye. It's oh, cool yeah, that yeah. you and Mike kind of send it back and forth to each other. Oh yeah. I yeah. like that a lot. That's pretty fucking cool. Yeah, like I'll have a script and then I'll send it to him and then like, he'll send me back a totally different script and then I'll send him back the final script and like, that's how mm-hmm. we did the Linus set thing. I think he actually mentioned that to me when we were recording the episode. Oh yeah? Yeah, that like, you guys are always rewriting it. What do you say about me? Did you talk shit or? No, bro. It was all good things. From what I remember, usually when I do this stuff, I kind of black out because it's so hot. Oh, but yeah. from, from what I remember, I mean. Like the guests or the wings? For the guests and the wings, both. So when Mike was here, he was so hot, you backed, blacked out? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I do that Shout a lot, out too. Shout Mike. It's true. No, he's a great dude, man. He's, he was funny as shit. Yeah. Funny shit. I think, I think I'm at the level where I'm going to take him one bite of these wings. No, man. You still want to eat them? Already? Oh, no. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> I don't want to be a pussy. Nah, bro. You're good, man. A lot of people at this point only start to take like one or two bites. I'm just starved. That's why I'm eating the whole thing. Yeah, if you just go at it like that, you'll be fine. So, yeah, again, like I want to go back to Newfoundland versus, man, because, and Justin Murphy as well. Because, man, Newfoundland versus Christmas. I swear it will be forever embedded in my brain. Like Justin Murphy on top of that fucking tree, swinging back and forth. That was like a childhood memory of mine. <laughs> that's crazy. That was such a good video, man. Yeah, that, that's one of those videos, like, whenever I watch. Like, I know it means so much to other people. But it's so weird to me because, like, so many people have talked to me about that video. and like I, I would assume so. How they love it. Yeah. And then it's so weird for me because it's like, I made it. Yep. Well, me and Mark made it. Yeah. And, I'm like, we don't look at it like that. Like... Everyone looks at it like, man, this video was so fucking funny and so, like, insane back in the day. And it's just, for me, like, it's like a memory. Like, you know what I mean? No, that's fair. Yep, yep. So, so, I had asked to, I rewatched it today because it was funny as shit. Who, who's the fella in the glasses? Mark LeMessure. He don't be a, he don't be a parent anymore, does he? Yeah, he, um, 
He lives in Vancouver now. Mm. Um, typical. Fair enough. Go west. Mainlander. Yeah. Yep. 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 But he, um, yeah, he comes back. He's in, uh, yeah, geez. He, I think it's been a minute since he's been in a mm-hmm. video, but whenever he comes back, he's always like, Is, are you guys filming? And I'm just he like, wants to be involved. Yeah. And I'm cool. like, fuck, fuck it, man. Get in. So was he in any recent videos? Yeah, he, um, like, we're good friends. Me and him grew up next to each other in Portugal Cove, but he was, like, the first friend I ever had. Okay. That's yeah. nice. Yeah. So he's like your age in your school. He's like, like a year younger than me. Oh, sweet, sweet. So we grew up as little babies together, and then uh, uh, then we flourished into men. And um, tried to start making some content. Yeah, and then like he was just like yeah. So then we put him as the uh, mainlander, and everyone hated him. And we turked him with uh, big turk bars. There's like so there's a thing that we did in Newfoundland versus where you take out a big turk bar and you turk mainlanders. So okay. you click big Turk bars at Mainliners. And um, I remember once a school contacted me and they were like, uh, you need to change your videos because all the mainland kids, Mainlander kids at school mm-hmm. are getting big Turk bars flicked at them. No way. That was, my, that, that that was like the proudest friend. moment of my life. So I did have a question following all that. Okay. And I, I don't know if you touched on it or not. Uh, let's get into the next one. Then I'll ask you the question. Okay. You ready? This one here is the Heartbeat Scorpion. Oh, well, that sounds good. After this, it's goes a little downhill, but this one is probably the last good one, okay. flavor-wise. Eat it all. I like this pressure. <laughs> Do you have a favorite video of yourself, like, a, or even a memorable moment while you were recording a video? I think my fav- one of my favorite videos ever was uh, New <coughs> Newfoundland version of E.T., and, um, yeah, so I think, like, that was, like, because I just remember being up there with no script, and we just came up with it at the top of our heads. We're like, mm-hmm. now say this, now say this. And it was just so funny. Um, it was, like, the first time in my life, as I was uh, editing a video, I was dying laughing. Yep, yep. And perfect. I just remember that video so clearly, how funny I thought it was, and then when we put it out, it just blew the fuck up. There's so many videos I watch, and I was just, like, hate myself. Me too. Like you're like watching it, you're just like, fuck, like I should have did this differently, I should have mm-hmm. did this. And these are like videos that just recently came out, like, you know what I mean? Like, So you're 16 years at it and you're still finding ways to improve and... and oh yeah, you know. like I'll put out, if I've made a video right, like tonight, and I watched it tomorrow, I would like critique, like I'd be like, I should have did this differently, I should have did that. Well, that's not really bad with that though. Um, yeah, so, let's get into the next one. This is where it gets a little bit intense. Okay. So, do you have any other... You know, hobbies outside of creating content? Well, I'm, I'm a super big uh, nerd. Like, I love comic book movies and comic books. And I have a PS5, so I've been gaming hardcore lately. Okay. Um, I, uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a fucking nerd. Right, what game sure. are you playing? I just, for the, because I was always an Xbox guy. So I just finished Last of Us recently. Oh, now I'm playing, now I'm obsessed with uh, NHL. There you go. I, Finally got the last NHL game, but yeah, I'm a, I am wouldn't say I'm a big gamer, but I'm definitely gaming more now than I usually do. Perfect, man. I also that. have the old ones. I have a Super Nintendo. All right. Oh, God. Now we get into the real deal shit. This is Stargazer. If it makes any feeling better, it's the same company that made these two. So, I mean, how bad could it be? Right? right. I mean, really. I mean, how bad could it really be? So, Stargazer. Hot sauce. Uh, it does say ultra hot. But what, what does a bottle mean? Bottle don't mean nothing. If I was going to listen to a bottle all day. Exactly. Right. Where the fuck would I be? Nowhere. Let's get it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to eat the whole thing. It's well, up to you yourself. You do you, man. I'm going to do a bite. It's up to yourself what you want to do. Mmm, that's so good. It is good. <laughs> that's so good. <laughs> we'll have another bite. You know what? That's so good. That's <laughs> true. I'm gonna throw it in the garbage. <laughs> it actually kind of sucks, man. <laughs> the sauce? I don't like the taste of the sauce. No? Oh, man. I'm not finished it. <laughs> um, I could feel this one in my butthole. Um, you ever started doing stand up comedy yourself? Uh, no, because I feel like uh, my interests are not stand up comedy. Like, when we, when me and Mike got together, I think we worked so well. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay, man. No. 
I was trying uh, to clap my back my throat. Yeah, so when me and Mike got together, like he wanted to be a stand up comedian and I wanted to make movies. So that's why the so you actually want to make movies. Yeah, I want to be like a writer and shit, but I just happened to like I guess I don't want to say that I'm funny, but I happen to like be better at like making comedy type things. Mm -hmm. So, like, I enjoy the writing and editing aspect more so than the stand Like, I don't have any dreams of being a stand-up comedian. I no. dream of, like, making a movie or something. Do you feel any pressure to be funny when someone comes up to you? Yes. I remember once at Simon Fest, this old woman came up to me. And she said, I know you. You're the funny guy from YouTube. And then I was like, oh, I swear to God, this as long as the conversation was. I was like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's me. And then she's like, um, I thought you'd be funnier in person. Bro, isn't that crazy? Oh, yeah. I get that a lot. Yeah, man. Like, you shouldn't have to be funny 24-7. Like I said, that puts a lot of pressure on you. I know. Shouldn't, yeah. Well, I mean, like, I feel like Mike gets it more than me. Oh, for because, sure. Because, like, Mike is, like, such a character. Mm, there you go. Okay, yeah. hang on a second. Give me, like, ask me. <laughs> give me two more seconds. <laughs> <laughs> These next two are nothing compared to this one. <sighs> Fuck you, man. I don't like you anymore, man. Cheers. Cheers. Not many people like me after I do this, to be honest. <sighs> I'm taking a bite. I don't ever get a message after this. <laughs> no one ever follows up with me. Yeah, so I'm like, doing... <laughs> dude, I, I tell you one thing. I'm not sliding your DMs after this. Like, you won't get, at 3 a.m., you won't get a message you up from me. <laughs> get a 3 a.m. fucking message. Okay. Yeah. Oh, man, that tastes good. Did I have that in a spicy version, or? <laughs> Actually, this one here's not too bad. Kind of a creeper. As you go home and you drive home. Oh, okay. So, oh, so, you know you're gonna fuck me up later when I'm with my real life. <laughs> yeah. Okay. When I pet my cat, he's gonna feel. Don't like, pet your cat. I might. <laughs> well, I mean, mess up yourself. <laughs> Holy fuck. I can't Jesus. wait to go home and pet my cat's eyes. <laughs> All right, bro. Let's get into this. You did great so far. You're doing fucking amazing. We're just going to that one right now. Honestly, it's better if we just do this. I ask you a question and we do the outro. Hey, let's do it. Let's do it. All right. So this is NFOD. Okay. From Winging It. Let's get into it. Okay. And then I'll ask you one quick question before we get out of here. Okay. All right. I'm only taking one bite of this one. Okay. But this one is pretty fucking intense. This might be for me. Mmm, Winging It. <laughs> you made great sauce. Justin, thank you very much. Come on, show, man. Really appreciate it. Yeah, What's man. next for you, bro? I uh, just like making outhouse videos. We're gonna keep making them, keep doing what we're doing. And uh, dude, I rubbed my eye again. Stop rubbing your eye, bro. <coughs> Would you ever Wait a minute, man. That is something, isn't it? It is. There's bro. a lot going on right now. It is. Uh, thank you, bro. Thanks yeah. for coming, show. I really do appreciate it. I know you're struggling right now. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and comment. Any last minute words to the viewers, anything like that? Um, thanks for having me on. Yep. I had a great time. Yep, looks like it. And uh, yeah, I hope uh, I'm crying. There it is. There it is. I'm just thinking of Toy Story 3, really. Oh, are you? That's what you do? No. All right, well, thank you very much for watching this video. We really appreciate it. Justin, again, thank you for coming on the show. If you guys liked it, make sure to like, subscribe. Catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.